Hey Ravens, I'm Adam Cook alongside Rosie Klausner and welcome to Game Day Northwest. Today we have stories on golf, gymnastics, football and your Sunflower League champion Raven volleyball team. The girls golf team traveled to St. Andrews last Wednesday to compete in Sunflower League play. Let's swing it over to Alex Gable with the details. Last Wednesday the girls golf team went to St. Andrews golf course for Sunflower League play. The Ravens took second in the league with Rosie Klausner placing fourth, Abu Julo placing sixth and Victoria Klausner placing tenth. They will advance to regionals and then to state. They'll be golfing at the Country Club of Leewood for Kansas State Tournament on Monday, October 18th. For Game Day Northwest, this has been Alex Cable, now back to the desk. Thanks, Alex. And just this past Monday, the girls' golf team continued their hot streak, finishing first overall at regionals with Rosie Clauser taking first individually. Little sister Rose Victoria Clauser finished fourth and Abby Julo placing sixth. Great job, girls. Last Saturday, the gymnastics team traveled to Lawrence for a big Sunflower League meet. Let's flip it over to Rowan Stanley with the details. The Olathe Northwest Gymnastics team headed to Lawrence for a league meet last Saturday. The Lady Ravens continued to heat up on the mat as they put together another strong performance as a team. Leading Northwest in every category was either Brooke Illum or Maddie Fentiman. Team point total of 99.6 points left Northwest in 7th place in the league as they prepare for state on October 22nd. For Game Day Northwest, this has been Roan Stanley. Thanks, Roan. Let's wish them the them luck at their next meet. The Raven football season has been a roller coaster of emotions. The team lost three heartbreakers to begin the season and has bounced back with two big victories, including a 34 to nothing pounding of Leavenworth. Last Friday night, the Ravens battled Lawrence Free State looking to make it three in a row. Let's hand it off to Bryce Lunger with the highlights. The Ravens took on the Free State Firebirds this past Friday in Lawrence to see if they could get their record to three and three. The first quarter opened up with a big stop by the Raven defensive line, forcing Free State to punt. Eastern Cupper on offense came on for the first time with a five-yard reception from senior Max Donahue, but the Ravens ended up punting on fourth down. In the second quarter, Firebirds receiver gets tangled up, stays on his feet to get down to the Northwest 15-yard line, leading to a 15-yard rushing touchdown for the first score of the game with six minutes remaining in the first half. Junior quarterback Braden Cook got some snaps in the fourth quarter to try and get something going for the Ravens offense, completing a pass to Charles Elvin, a couple 10-yard runs to try and get some points on the board. The Ravens fought hard but ended up losing the game 35-0. The team will take on Olathe North this Friday at 7 o'clock. Way to fight hard, Ravens. Let's take it to Olathe North this Friday. Last Thursday, the Raven volleyball team took on Olathe South and Shrimish Northwest looking to wrap up another Sunflower League championship. Let's send it to Catherine Farewell with the story. The MW Raven volleyball team was in Sunflower League action last Thursday night, October 6th. The Ravens took on Aletha South in the first game. They won the first set 25-15, but then in the second set, the Falcons bounced back and at one point led by three points. That didn't stop the Ravens. They dominated the second set and won 25-20, a 2-0 sweep. ONW then took on Shawnee Mission Northwest. They fell in the first set 25-23, but they bounced back winning the second set 25-11 and the third set 25-15. The Lady Ravens are back-to-back -back Sunflower League champions. They are now 22-3 on the season. For Game D Northwest has been Catherine Farewell. Congratulations to Coach Lenz and all of the Raven volleyball players on this great achievement. Good luck in your drive to state. That's all we have today for Game Day Northwest. For Adam Cook, I'm Rosie Klausner. Now back to the desk.